and superhero get superhero outfits, and you liked yours. Oh, man. Ah, yeah. Yes, like, I did. Holy Like, yes. you yeah. wore it more than you were meant to, didn't you? <laughs> He'd never take there's, it off. There's, yeah. <laughs> there's not a scene I don't wear it in. <laughs> and did they offer you other clothes? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Ray, let me ask you something. If they offered you that, would you ever take <laughs> no. that off? I would never take it off. Thank you. I would never take it off. Do you fly in this movie? Yes, I, but I, I fly generally anyway. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, mind you, someone else has got a new suit. Spider-Man's got a new suit. Oh, Ooh. yes. Wow. Well, but now, you really like this suit. suit, right? I do, yes. Um, because I can go to the bathroom in it, mainly. <laughs> it's funny, if you watch Iron Man 1, <laughs> Robert wore the full suit, and then if you watch Iron Man 2, he wore, like, American football pads that were red and gold. I'm on my fifth movie, <laughs> and I just got a zipper. <laughs> <laughs> so it's been a steady climb, but I'm... Well, you earned it, kid, you know. <laughs> I find that when you make enough movies, you get a zipper right <laughs> at some point. <laughs> but you got to earn it. <laughs> it's one of those obstacles that are put in front of you. you got to learn how... Who is Dave the Frog, and why has Dave the Frog got something to do with you? Dave the Frog that's in, in my mouth. Well, this is what I hear. What is that story? Right. Um, <laughs> so we have to do red carpets all the time and take pictures, and yeah. I find it very awkward when they're all shouting at you and stuff. And uh, a fan of mine tweeted a picture of me saying, Tom Holland looks like he has a frog in his mouth <laughs> when he's taking paparazzi pictures. And I thought it was hilarious, so I reposted the picture, which then went viral, and everyone found it hilarious. But then weeks go by, and I'd look at myself in the mirror and be like, maybe I do look like I have a frog. This is the, I think this is the original tweet. This is you. Oh, I can see that. You do look like you've got something in your mouth. I think it's because I'm trying to go for the chiseled jaw kind of look. Oh, you're It's just not working. I think that's what that was. But, Tom, you did the proper British thing. You went to an all-boys school. Is that right? Yes, yeah, I did, yeah. Were you well-behaved? No, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> but, but then, for, oddly, for Spider-Man, they sent you back to school. Uh, well, it was a it was a joke. They, they don't obviously understand my British sarcasm. I said, wouldn't it be funny if I went to an American high school undercover to see what it would be like to be an American high schooler? And Marvel were like, that's amazing. Let's set it up. Wow. So, <laughs> six weeks later, I'm like with a backpack, really? a pencil case, books, on my way to the school, the Bronx School of Science, oh, which is a school for genius kids. And believe me, everyone, I am not no genius. <laughs> <laughs> um, and yeah, so I enrolled in a high school for three days. I had like an accent, a fake name, a backstory. What and was they, your fake name? Ben Perkins, who's my acting coach okay. from when I was a kid. But they paired me with um, a kid called Arun, and I was supposed to be his brother or something like that. And Arun is an Indian kid. And when I came in, everyone was like, <laughs> is that really your brother? And we're like, yeah, we're just distant brothers from, you know, who? <laughs> anyway, moving on. Um, this is a science school. They can figure yeah, things out. Like, no, no way that works. That doesn't work. Uh, but, didn't you, but then you did, did you confide in oh, some yeah. people? <laughs> so I was sitting next to this very pretty girl in class. And you have to go through an exam process to get into this school, which obviously I didn't do. Um, and she's like, hey, man, what's your deal? How are you here? I was like, well, let me tell you my secret. I'm actually, um, Undercover. I'm actually Spider-Man. <laughs> she's like, dude, you're fucking nuts, bro. What <laughs> are you, really? And I'm like, no, seriously, I'm Spider-Man. <laughs> Obviously, none of my movies had come out. No one knew about it. It was a big secret. So I just looked like some nutter <laughs> that showed up for three days and then disappeared. <laughs> yeah, she's laughing now. She's like, yeah. oh, yeah, I had him right there the bottom. <laughs> What's interesting about this is that that's is actually based on a true story. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's, yeah. yeah. But actually, the 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 holograms when we're doing the holograms, oh, obviously dude. they're not there when you're doing them, and I hadn't really done a movie like this before, you know. And so they're they're just, I, you know, the first time I did it, they were like, I, I didn't take it, I didn't look at anything. I was just describing, it. like, you know, their ho their hologram's going to be spinning around in front of you, and and Tom was like, oh yeah, they put like things right in front of that thing, and so I. I didn't know what to do. They said, just dart your eyes around, <laughs> like you're looking at something. <laughs> just like this. Yeah. And you have to move it. Yeah. yeah. I was like, they're from another planet. <laughs> <laughs> or, I, you know. You're, ruin you you're ruining the magic. Because, but in, in terms of the suits, because Gwyneth, I, I sort of, you know, you don't think of Pepper as, as kind of a, a superhero -y person. She was more human, yeah. but you did get to wear the suit. Yeah, a few times I yeah. did, yeah. And um, was it in Iron Man 2? 3. 3. <laughs> 3. <laughs> Iron Man 2. 
Iron Man 3. <laughs> oh, and Endgame. You're in it in the Endgame as well. And Endgame. And Infinity. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and were you really in the suit? Yeah, as Tom was saying, they've evolved the suit. So in Iron Man 1, Robert was wearing huge armor, and by the time it got around to whatever the last one was, <laughs> we were sort of half and half. I really don't know the names of these people. I know. <laughs> do you? Honestly, do you? No, no I, I can't. Exactly. I can't. Um, so <laughs> mine didn't have a zipper, but I guess I don't need a zipper. In All the that same steaming. Way. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> How that works? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a subway. Ooh. <laughs> you have to get into them like with talcum powder and people pulling them up and. Yeah. What are we talking yeah. about right now? <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry, I just didn't make it. Yeah. Good point. Yep. Good point. I just wanted to. The suit. My last <laughs> suit, I had to definitely wiggle into it. Mm. Yeah. I've done some CGI and it's oh, like yeah. putting on a really tight uh, 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 wetsuit or a scuba outfit. Yeah. Yeah, but it feels so nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's funny. That's the excitement of being Spider-Man, because this is your third, fourth, third? My third, my third, third yes. So uh, is it still as exciting as it was, or are you a bit kind of blasé about being Spider-Man now? No, I mean, you can't really. I mean, I remember seeing Avengers 1 with one of my best friends, Tom Hutton, in the cinema as a kid, so excited. And now I'm in it, you know. I'm walking around with Iron Man and Captain America, and I can now kind of call them peers and stuff. So yeah. it's it's still pretty surreal. Um, but uh, this one's definitely been a whirlwind. It's been insane. And what's sweet is because I think a lot of actors, when they get roles like this, they mm. have to say, "Oh yeah, no, it's a thrill." Da, da, da. <laughs> but for you, it, this is genuine because you post these incredibly sweet pictures. Uh, this is you as a young boy. Aww. 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 I mean, you are playing with yourself. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, but that is so sweet. And then this one, this is amazing. You were, I think, back in your house and you found this. Yeah. Oh. And so that was genuinely yours. That was my first ever Spider Man costume, yeah, which my lovely mum, who's here tonight, kept for me. And oh. now, were you one of those kids who like wore it to funerals and weddings and things? <laughs> I, was, I slept in that thing. That thing still stinks today. <laughs> There's no washers that can make that thing wearable. <laughs> oh. All right. Uh, <laughs> Am I, am I right in thinking that the Spider-Man outfit, is, as, it, as we knew it, is gone now? No. Well, yes, yes, it is. Basically... Spoiler! Uh, <laughs> essentially, in this film, I have a new suit, which Tony Stark gave me. It's an upgrade, and uh, it's too fantastical to exist in real life. So, I essentially... There it is. That's the first time I've seen it. Wow, it looks great. <laughs> <laughs> Are you glad you came tonight? I know. Yeah, I'm learning so much. Um, it looks nice. Not, is, is that metal? I don't know, Graham. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the plot kind of revolves around you going on a school trip to, to Europe. Yes, it does, yeah. The film is um, a direct continuation of Avengers Endgame. So we deal with the ramifications of the blip, of the death of Tony Stark. Sorry to anyone who hasn't seen the film. <laughs> if you haven't, then you're living under a rock. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, it's... Well, you, well, you were in you it. Haven't seen you were in it. You're a widow. Don't spoil it for no, Gwyneth. No, I'm sorry. Don't spoil it for <laughs> Gwyneth. Let her discover that herself. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> so the story is basically Spider Man trying to take a break. He's trying to put, hang up the Spider Man suit and escape the responsibility of being a superhero. But what he learns throughout the course of the film is that that responsibility isn't something you can run away from. Um, and that's when we team up and we sort of become best buds on and off screen. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and we fight these <laughs> elemental creatures. These... But now, filming together, like, Jake, mm. uh, Tom, it sounds like, was quite unsympathetic to you while you were filming. When, when didn't you get a little... A little... Peaky in. Oh well, uh, yeah. We were shooting a well. Uh, we were shooting a scene, and yeah. I, I, uh, I got, a, I got, I, I got sick. I, I, I was very nauseous throughout the day, and and in the middle of the t one of the takes, I, I, th I threw up, in the yeah. middle of the take, and uh, kept going. You know, but that's how that's what acting's all about. <laughs> I was no. sitting opposite him, and I was, I was like, how is he doing that? <laughs> 
he is so good. He looks so tortured and so unwell and so, <laughs> and so like, like hurt. And then he basically just had a stomach bug. <laughs> <laughs> and, and they actually CGI'd the vomit out of the shot. But if you look in the movie, in the movie at this, my mouth is just partially open at one. I'm kidding. Are you kidding? <laughs> 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 I was going to go back and see it again. Yeah. 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 It was right I there. Yeah. I mean, my That's God. the Marvel Universe. <laughs> just painting out the vomit. Yeah. 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 Right chunk. But my <laughs> eyes were so expressive that they had to keep it in the movie. That so good. They couldn't redo the shot, so you know? <laughs>